everyone, it's Paige from the Page Turner. Today I'm here to do my Bee Fest book haul. So I attended Bee Fest with my sister Kaylin. Say hi. Hi. And we had a really great time. So we went to the Barnes and Noble in Glendora, California. It's in Southern California. And the employees there were super nice and we had a really great time. We got a lot of awesome stuff and we are gonna show it all to you. Oh, you should do this. We're gonna show it all. So we first answered questions from Underlined about a whole bunch of books. Too many books. Yeah, a lot. And I ended up winning. So I won this awesome tote bag. It's very nice. It has a zipper. <laughs> it's gold. It's it's gold. So we won that. I won that. And then I got in there two arcs. One is called Otherworld and this is by Jason Siegel and Kristen Miller. This comes out in November. I think I've heard about this um, maybe on Goodreads or something, but I hadn't like seen it anywhere else. So we'll see how it goes. And then the other one that we got was A Short History of the Girl Next Door by Jared Reck. And we both got a copy of this at Y'all West, so we'll probably do a giveaway for this one. So in a surprising turn of events, I actually beat Paige at a trivia questionnaire. Yes, it was <laughs> embarrassing. On like pure luck. So I got this tote bag that's super pretty. It has like sparkles on it. And then, and it matches the book that's inside, that's an arc, that's called The Hazelwood by Melissa, Melissa Albert. Albert. This comes out in January of next year. Yeah. And, and the cover is also very pretty. So. Yeah, it's also very shiny. I got a copy and a tote bag too because they had extra and they let us take one, another one when we were leaving. So that was super nice of them. Thank you, Barnes & Noble. Yes. So now you. we're matching! Yay! Yay! The next trivia that we were answering was all about superheroes like Wonder Woman, Batman, Sp Superman, I almost said Spider-Man. Catwoman. And I won that one as well and I got a copy of Batman Nightwalker by Marie Lu. And I'm so excited for this because I got the Wonder Woman one by Lee Bardugo at Y'all West and I loved that and I'm very excited to have the next one in the, what is this series? Oh, the Superhero Icon series. So I'm very excited to read this one too. Unlike when she got the lead Bardugo Wonder Woman copy, she did not cry when she got this copy. Yeah. So. Um, and then <laughs> as like a condolence prize for not knowing pretty much any of the answers, I got pins for your backpack or whatnot. But We actually got a, quite a few of these, so I'll probably do a giveaway of those as well. So I've lost track of when we got what, but I also won the Booked All Week by Novel Tote. So in that tote was Frost Blood by Ellie Blake. And I believe this one's already out, right? Yeah, it is already out. Sam, uh, who I talk about all the time, really loves this book. The sequel just came out, I believe. Also in that was Expelled by James Patterson and Emily Raymond that comes out October 23rd. And this one looks really interesting. Yeah, I haven't heard anything about this one. I didn't even know that James... I mean, James Patterson was always writing stuff, but I hadn't heard anything about this, so... We'll yeah. have to check it out and see how it is. It looks like it'll be a quick read. Yeah, definitely. Like, the big print margins, is really big, yeah. Really big print, so. Which means nothing, I guess, for the final copy, but also it just seems pretty thin anyway, so. Yeah. Yeah. The end they offered if we wanted to take any other totes because they had some extra ones left over. I got this Sleep, Eat, Read, Repeat by Penguin Teen, which is super cute. Very cute. I, I want, like, all the totes that Yeah, the, they do the really good make. totes. So in that tote was People Like Us by Dana Mel, which will come out in February 2018. It says it's supposed to be like 13 Reasons Why and Pretty Little Liars, but I haven't heard anything about this. So. I'm super excited. I'm for sure reading that one because it looks super cute. Yeah. I like the cover design on it. So Killeen. the other one that I got was The Orphan Monster Spy by Matt Killeen, which will be on sale March 2018. Another one that I haven't heard anything about, so we'll see how that one is too. Yeah, it's... I think it's supposed to be World War II based. It's still um, quite a bit of time, too, before yeah. it comes out. So the other tote that they offered was this Shadowhunters one, um, which I don't really like Shadowhunters at all, and I don't really like Cassandra Clare, but I was still, like, thankful for them to give this to me because that was a really cool gift. Um, so this is Lord of Shadows, which is the second book in the Dark Artifices series. Um, I tried to read Lady Midnight, but gave up on it. There's a link below that you can check out. And it also came with a little, a little pin too. So I'll probably do a giveaway or end up selling this or something just because I don't, like I said, I don't really like Cassandra Clare and I find the series kind of boring. So, but yeah, that was still really nice of them. 
They also gave us three free like little comics um, when we were doing the Batman and Superman Wonder Woman trivia stuff, yeah. so that was kind of cool too. There was one for everyone that participated. And then they also had a swag table with like tons of stuff, so we got a bunch of samplers, um, stickers, stickers. Yeah, we got these little crowns from the Three Dark Crowns series. There's advertisements Tattoos. for John Green's newest book. I can't um, wait. More samplers for Batman, which I'll probably be giving away. Um, advertising for Penguin Teen, um, advertising for Bee Fest, which was obviously today, and then a little like activity books. Oh, did you see this? It was Renegades by yeah, Marissa Meyer. Like, yeah, so advertising for that as well. More stuff I'll probably be giving away. Previews of Batman. Of Genuine Fraud. Oh, the um, Penguin mm. Teen Game Changer series, which is Warcross, um, Kristen Kishore's Jane Unlimited, There's Someone Inside Your House by Stephanie Perkins. Things I'm Seeing Without You by Peter ooh, Bognani and Forest of a Thousand Lanterns by Julie C. Dow. A bunch of bloggers got the ARC packs of these, but this is just like the sampler of it. Um, we also got ARCs of Goldie Moldavsky's newest book, No Good Deed, at Y'all West, but these are the samplers as well, so if I do a giveaway, I'll probably just give both away. Oh, there's swag from um, Mask, Mask of Shadows, Shadows, which is coming out That's soon. That's a sticker. So just like... Tons of really cool awesome stuff, cool stuff that we'll probably end up giving away. I freaking love underlined, um, which is formally first line, right? First in first line. First in line. Like, they're at everything that we've of... been to, they're like... Yeah, they're really awesome. Super awesome about everything. They give out free arcs all the time. And, and a lot of swag. Yeah, and just like... They're really good. Like, they're really good about interacting on social, social media. media, too. You should sign up for their emails, too. They have really fun emails. You can yeah. always try to win stuff. So I've never gone to B-Fest before. They had one last year, but obviously I wasn't able to go, I think, because I was still in school. But we had a really great time, and we'll probably go again eventually. Um, yeah. And I just want to say thank you to Glendora, the Barnes & Noble there. The employees were super fun, super awesome. We had just had a really great time yeah. hanging out, talking books, and... Cool. Um, if you like this video, give a thumbs up, hit subscribe, leave a comment if you went to your own local Bee Fest, if you had fun times and got some of the same stuff. Um, otherwise, I will see you in the next video. Bye! I won't be in the next video. Good. So just a quick plug, um, my sister and my mom are both making book sleeves. Um, you can follow them below at SoCal Girls. They have an Instagram. and. If you're not familiar, book sleeves are just for books like when you're traveling, just to like kind of protect them. So um, these are really awesome because they're handmade, really high quality, really vibrant fabric as you can tell. They fit like fairly large books. As you can see. Um, even thicker than this in Like there. I put Gemina in here and Gemina is huge. Yeah. We have a whole bunch of different patterns. They'll be up for sale soon, but if you want to be the first to know when they go on sale, go follow us on Instagram and Twitter and all that good stuff. Um, to find out when they're going to be live. Hi. <laughs> Follow me on Instagram. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> so then the next no, I'm So, oh, I've lost track of how we won, what, in what order we won stuff, but in the, in, in the tote was Frostbud, Blood, Frost Blood by... Ellie Blake. Okay, let's start over. Yeah. I was like, you need to do that over again. Do you want me to just say it? Peach. And then they offered me a Shadow Hunters tote bag, <laughs> which Sorry. we're not fans of Shadow Hunters or Cassandra Clare at all. <laughs> and this, I really don't like Cassandra Clare. <laughs> Stop killing. Okay, let's do that one over. No yeah. So thank you. Hi. And then what's your renegade name? Okay, so first letter of your first name. So for you, that's K. So you're strong. strong. No, do yours. Okay, so first letter of your first name for me, that's P. Daring. First letter of your last name, M. Daring Wish. Mine's Strong Wish, because we have the same last name. Obviously. So. Yeah. I got the ARC box of this, but I haven't read it yet, so I don't really know what any of this means yet. It was a really cool little Just box. Sitting right there.